Hello again. If you've got an air sprayer and you're feeling a little bit restricted with what it can do, well, in this video, I'm going to show you the one thing you can get for your spray that's going to make it a lot more versatile, a lot more capable of doing a few more different jobs for you, and also hopefully make you a bit more money. But all that is coming up after this. <laughs> Well, this is it, the hopper. If you bought yourself a PP90, this machine here, great little machine, probably the equivalent to the Graco GX21, so sort of same sort of money. Brilliant little machine. The only drawback is, um, if when it comes to doing woodwork, uh, you've got a 15 meter hose here, so if you're doing ceilings or walls, it's not a problem because you know, you've got the product in there, you're gonna get through quite a bit, but when it comes to woodwork, you're not gonna be using so much product. So in that respect, this is where the hopper comes in because you can put a lesser amount of product into the hopper than you would in the hose. So uh, in that respect, it's a great little gadget. Now, it bolts together. There's a bracket that bolts to the machine and also there's a foot that then supports the hopper as well. So it's quite sturdy when it's full. Uh, the only thing is when it is full, it's a little bit unbalanced when you try and pick it up. But, to be honest, if you're spraying, you don't really want to be picking up, you, so it shouldn't be too much of an issue. Anyway, it's um, quite quite sturdy. The, the plastic it comes is well well made, very sturdy. The, the wall of the of the, the container is is well fitted. It's nice and solid. Uh, you've got the the feed the return hose here, feed hose here. Uh, all, it all goes together in about five minutes. It comes with the brackets, the bolts, everything you need to put it together. And then if you do want to take it apart and put the original hose back on for some, this is not the most attractive of designs. I don't know why they don't like this. But anyway, if you do want to put this back on, like I say, five minutes and you can go from this back to this, which is great. Uh, the only other thing I would say is uh, to replace this uh, 15 meter hose and maybe get a seven and a half meter hose with the whip hose that, that you can buy as well I think all this is available from paint shack in Windlesham they're online have a look or give them a call this hopper I know is about about 150 pounds not too sure about the 50 the seven and a half meter hose or the whip hose you'll have to give them a call and find out what that costs but like I say this is a very it makes this sprayer a very versatile sort of little setup uh, by adding this hopper. It's, um, it's really served us well. We've been using it for about four weeks and we've, yeah, we've definitely used this machine more with the hopper uh, and found more jobs for it. Uh, and it's earned more money for us than we would if we just stuck with the, with the hose it comes with this, this, you know, this feed hose because you know, you're more inclined to use this for woodwork now rather than uh, just, you, just ceilings and walls. Uh, if you found this useful, why not just click the like button and it will let people know that um, you're enjoying what you're seeing. Also, if you like this video, you might like this one, or if not, try this one. 